I believe fire is one of man's greatest discoveries and it's always fascinated me, from the heat it can generate to the mass destruction a single flame can create. In today's video, I'm going to try and attempt to tick off another of my bucket list challenges and I'm going to attempt to walk on hot coals without burning myself. Let's give it a go. So, as I said, in these challenges I am going to try and bring other people in and today I'm going to try and get my youngest brother David involved. It's just ringing. Hi. Hey Dave, you alright? Yeah, are you? Yeah, I'm good. Listen, I need a favour from you. Okay, go for it. Um, what are you doing later this evening? Will you come round to the new house? Yeah, fine. I got nothing to say. Okay, cool. Um, I know it's warm out now, but bring some shorts because it's getting warmer later. Oh, okay. You're going to bring some sun cream as well? Yeah, yeah, I've got you. Don't worry. <laughs> okay, good. All right. Thanks, mate. I'll, uh, I'll see you a bit later. All right. No worries. See you in a bit. All right. Bye-bye. All right. Okay, so I don't think he has a clue, which is good. Um, the reason that I am choosing Dave is because although he's 10 years younger than me, I've always admired the fact that if he puts his mind to it, he can just set himself off and go and achieve it straight away. So this is going to be obviously testing his mind, testing his bottle. Um, fingers crossed. I think he'll step up to the plate. But before we do anything, we need supplies. So we are on the run now. First thing we need to get is some wood. Unfortunately, we weren't allowed to film in there, but we've got the essentials. The first thing you need for fire is fuel. And we've gone for the hardwood logs. But we've gone for the hardwood because they're ready to burn. They go quickly, they're kiln dried, and hopefully they're not going to burn our feet. Fingers crossed. Second thing, you need oxygen. That's around us. And then you need the ignition. We've got the long matches. Fingers crossed that'd be fine. And we've got a little something, something extra. A little party sauce to get us really going. Let's go and sit up. So we've got the four bags of logs. I'm going to build a little crib, going to take the membrane back so we don't set fire to that, obviously. Uh, and then just before Dave gets here, I'm going to set it alight, let it burn down a little, and then we're going to get to hot stepping. So my brother should be here in about 20 minutes. I am going to set fire to the crib, let it start to burn down. Safety first, I'm going to stand further back, put the camera down before I light it, but we've also got a fire extinguisher ready, just in case. Obviously nothing's going to go wrong. I am trained and I know how to use a fire extinguisher. It's what I do for a living. Now that side is fine. Walking on fire, first time for everything, correct? We have fire. I am quite a distance away because the heat that's coming off it is really kicking up. Um, my heart rate has gone up slightly, knowing that I'm going to be walking over it shortly. A little scared, I am not going to lie. Dave has no idea what I've got in store for him. Um, I, I really don't know what he thinks. I've just told him to come and he's just like, okay, I'll do it. But this is going to be a real test for both of us. Um, I'm looking forward to sharing it with him. Hello brother. Hi. You okay? Yes, I'm good. Do you, do you know why you're here? I have no idea why I'm here. Okay, I'm going to film your reaction. You have to try and guess. Basically, um, you're, you're going to help me tick off one of my bucket list things, but you're going to do it with me today. <laughs> what yeah? is it? Okay, well, let's see. Not, not yet. <laughs> Come on. It's fine, don't worry. Okay. So what, what, what can you see? I can see fire. <laughs> and what do you think we're going to be doing today, Dave? I think you're going to walk on it. No, no, we. <laughs> I'm walking on fire. When it burns down, we're going to walk on hot coals together, okay? <laughs> so drink up. I like the reaction. <laughs> are you down? No, really not. How are you feeling now? Are you a little scared? No, not really. Yes and no. 
Because if you do it and you're fine, then I'm, I'll do it. But if you do it and you burn yourself, then I ain't doing it. You don't want to go first? No. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Yeah, sure. Yeah. <laughs> and you can't run. Okay. <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, oh, that is hot. I'm not gonna lie, that is hot. But... Are you gonna do it? <laughs> I don't know, show me the bottom of your feet. <laughs> Okay, then. There's no burns, yeah? No, no burns. Okay. Do you know what, right? It is that, that first second, as soon as you open up your mind and just go, focus, step, step, step. Dave, if I can do it, I'm sure you can. <laughs> just focus, okay? Concentrate, believe you can do it. Come closer to it and be, be ready, okay? <laughs> Did you walk like that or fast? He, he, he walked past it, he didn't walk through it. Yeah, like that. It says, Oh, um, distribute all your weight. <laughs> You're saying, oh, like <laughs> no, no, I'm scared for you. Okay, I have faith in you. Okay, take when you're ready. Yeah, how's that? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Does it hurt a little bit? It's not pain, is it? It's just a, it's a quick second. How do you feel when you're about to step onto it? I don't know. I think seeing you do it first was. Makes it a bit easier. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that one hurt more. There's a little bit of. It's still very, very hot, as, as you can imagine. Whoa. Go free tips. I did free tips. <laughs> <laughs> that one hurt more. <laughs> that hurt? Yeah, that one hurt more. Are you okay? Yeah. Okay, not good. Like... It doesn't kill, does it? You're not going to be like... It's not a burn. It's um. It's, it's like, like you're treading on a plug. Yeah, a little... or, or like Lego. Lego. Yeah. yeah, so... But no, um, well done, Dave. I'm proud of you. I knew that you'd be able to do this with me. It's not burns or nothing, no. No. No? It just feels hot. <laughs> it just feels hot, yeah. Okay. So as we both just checked our feet, no burns. Um, it, it is like you said, it's like walking on Lego and it's a bit, mm. you can feel it. Um, well, I am proud of you, Dave. You know, it's, uh, it was scary. I'm not gonna lie, I was, I was a little apprehensive. When you get close to it and you, you can feel just with the heat on your hand, you're like, nah. But um, I wouldn't do this at home. Nah, do it at home. Don't listen to Dave, he's a trained <laughs> idiot. Um, but we are going to, I'm going to tick that off my list. You can tick that off your list as well, Dave. Um, I doubt that I'll ever have the opportunity to do it again. But now I can say I've done it. My feet hurt. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to sign off. I'll give you a little foot rub. I'll put some cream on it for you, all right? Sounds good. Okay. Um, guys, thank you very much for watching. We'll see you next time in New Adventure. Take care. So here is a quick update, it is a couple of days later and for those of you who are a bit squeamish, I'm about to show you my foot, pow, I have a blister, yes, um, it did burn, just, there's just one blister, both me and Dave did get a blister, from the second run I believe, um, it, it was hot and it hurt, I'm not going to lie to you, it, the blister, at the time it didn't hurt too much and then it's just got a little bit worse, so I think that maybe where we walked a little bit slower or we maybe dislodged a bit of the charcoal and it got stuck. Um, we didn't feel it at the time because of the adrenaline, but it does hurt. So if you are going to try it at home, um, be careful. I wouldn't recommend it. Just, just don't mess with fire. <laughs>